Uh, hello, my name is Alex and I'm from the UK. Um, I've come here uh, with a group of 40, well, 13 friends uh, to Tibet with a sea trip and uh, we've been here for just over a week. It has been fantastic. Um, I, I organized, well, I organized the trip for my group getting everyone organized, but uh, I was immediately helped out by Tony who organized everything perfectly for us. Our permits, our tour, our itinerary, our guides, our the accommodation, everything was fantastic. And all of this was prepared well before we got to Tibet. We had our train booked, our flight booked, everything was organized, everything was ready, which was fantastic because Tibet is a very hard country to get into and it's good to have someone who is reassuring to, to get you in. Uh, once we were in Tibet, uh, we were welcomed immediately by the guide and, and Tony and the driver with um, these uh, white scarves, which is given to distinguished guests in Tibetan culture. Um, and it was just, it's small touches like that it was just fantastic for our group. Um, we stayed in uh, great hotels. Our hotel in um, Lhasa was right near Boko, Bokom um, Market, which is near the temple, and we were able to walk around the Tibetan area freely and just experience and see Tibetans naturally. It's fantastic. Um, we learned a lot here. We went to we went inside uh, Polotela Palace, the Serena Monastery, uh, and Jokom Temple, and there we learned about um, many things about Tibetan history and, of course, Buddhism, which is a key component of Tibetan culture. And um, with this, we we we, we found out the, the true dedication of the Tibetans and their religion. The, the dedication is astounding. Um, and it really is uh, something quite special to see and makes Tibet a very unique country in itself for its devotion to its religion. Um, but other, other than just experiences, experiencing its culture, we were able to go out and I, I, I'm an enthusiastic hiker and uh, we were able to hike up mountains and the unbelievable climbs and views from the top of these mountains. The scenery in Tibet is sublime and we wouldn't have been able to do it without without the help of Tony and Sea Trip and, and our guide. And that's what I'd like to move on now. Our guide, Sunuk, who is a local Tibetan, was fantastic. His knowledge and his, and his ability to, to take us to places that other guides might not be able to take us to was just brilliant. When we were hiking up the mountain, I was on all fours, clawing up, and he was casually striding away like it was just a walk in the park, which was fantastic. And we met some uh, Tibetan shepherds on the mountain. We wouldn't have been able to talk to them, but Sanuk was able to. And he was joking with them and having a good time with them. And they were wanting to know where we were from. And we were talking through him to them, which was really nice. And in fact, some of our group weren't very good hikers. Um, so they were actually invited to this shepherd's house and he offered them barley beer and some uh, local Tibetan food, which they said was the, one of their best experiences here in Tibet, which is just fantastic. But um, we also had, of course, our driver, which, uh, got us to the places that we needed to get to and he was he was friendly he sang whilst driving which was very very nice but uh, uh it's just been a phenomenal experience and it's not over yet because uh we just we just arrived at the train station and we've got two days of scenic well a scenic tour out of tibet on our way to chengdu which is the perfect way to to slowly leave tibet because i think if we got on a plane we'd be very very upset so we can slowly leave the scenery whilst looking out of a train window which is going to be absolutely fantastic. But otherwise, I'd just like to say a complete, a, a, a huge thank you to Sea Trip and everyone else who helped organise this, especially Tony and Sanuk, who were brilliant in, in taking us around and showing us the country, um, which we wouldn't have been able to do by ourselves, and we don't think we would have had the same experience with any other tour company. So I'd like to thank them again, and I, I hope you can come here and enjoy the experiences yourself. So um, yeah, I hope that that, that 